Hey guys, and welcome to Supermarket Simulator. This is a Unity game that is single player, and it's early access, so we can't really do much yet in terms of settings. So it's really basic setup, and I haven't tried it yet, so you're gonna have to discover it alongside with me. But let's just head into the game right away. Welcome to Supermarket Simulator. You will start with a small store and grow to an awesome supermarket. Start by purchasing goods to sell and place them on the, onto the shelves. Don't forget to set the prices with a profit to avoid bankruptcy. Have fun. Okay. So here we are in a nice little neighborhood. It seems very quiet. I wonder if it's Sunday. But well, that's fine since we are not set up yet. So there's a quest mark here. I guess we're just going to... Have a look. Order your goods using your computer. Okay. So I guess what we have to spend, we have like $50. So what do people want most? I guess... Cereal slash bread fry. These are like basic products, right? Uh, so what happens if we... Oh, so it says unit price. I mean, pasta? Bread. Probably with bread, right? Let's get a couple of breads. Oh, so we're ordering boxes, probably. Let's just try and add one box that costs $11. And then people are going to need breakfast as well, right? So we're already at $47. I guess we can start with that. There we go. <laughs> I'm, all, I'm already out of cash. Okay, let's sh shut this down. What we have? We have management. Oh, so these actually require that we grow in level and we go all the way up to level 90. I can see we start with some pretty basic stuff and then at the other end, I'm going to say we evolve it into being able to sell beer and books. Fabric cleaner, and all the way at the end, we get the best beer. I think it is wine. Wow, sixty-five thousand dollars for that license. I hope we're gonna make some money out of this. Then we can hire cashiers. We have different types here that seem very similar. Complete checkout. Okay, so it requires additional levels as well. Storage costs 800. Customization not ready yet. Okay. Pick up the boxes. Uh, just arrived. Okay. Um, this is locked. Where are... Oh, they just left them outside. Well, we're lucky no one stole them, right? Can I, can I take them both? Nope. <laughs> okay. Place products onto the shelves, so we can place them. Ah! Oh no. How does this work? Oh, so I just click. Can I take that? But yeah, I can. That looks nice, I guess. Uh, let's keep this over here for now. I don't want it to look too messy. Oh, we can put it out in the trash. That's even better. Ah! And now the cereal. So let's let's keep them right next to each other so it doesn't look so empty. I mean, we do have one empty shell, but we're just getting started. Throw that out as well. Now we have to set the price. And can I remember what the unit price was? <laughs> Of course I can't. Uh, let's see. Shut that down. Market. Unit price for the cereal is two ninety nine, and bread is zero ninety nine. So that's what we have to go a little bit above, right? Two ninety nine. Oh, it actually says in here, so that was easy. Average cost price. Well, um, market price is. Oh, so this is the market. So, I mean, we're just starting up. So should we place ourselves just below the market? So, we go like 550, maybe? 
and market price for this is 396 so i guess we could market it at 350 Let's see what happens so we're a little bit cheaper than the rest of the uh, neighborhood and i guess you open the store by clicking the sign let's wait for oh we've got a customer hello hello sir yes uh, scan the products by clicking on, okay, oh, and then take his money, and put the money in, I need to give him 50 cents back, what, yeah, I just gave you 50 cents, oh, press space to approve the checkout, there we go, and you want cereal, you are using card, uh, enter exact total amount. You want both. Use some card. I guess nine dollars. So we're already ma making a little bit of money. This is this is good. <laughs> Everyone is eating bread and cereal. It's the most. Uh... Okay, let's see approve. Yeah, it's they're not exactly a health-centered people that lives in this neighborhood. Um, how can I move out? I just want to spend a lot more, or not a lot more, a little more money. We want to uh, increase our range, right? A bit of uh, pasta. Let's buy that. Oh, sorry, sir. I was busy making more money. Oh. More merchandise. Two breads. 50 cents. People are very busy now. What the shop is. Nine dollars. Okay, I think the wares are here so we can go get it. I can see at some point this is going to be a problem, isn't it? <laughs> that we're going to need cashiers because we will be busy stocking. And ordering stuff. Let's throw that out. Before the next customer comes in. And you can actually just you know, click away by pointing the mouse at that area here. Okay, let's set the price for these. Market price is $3.12. We're gonna go below again and go $2.99. And this one we're gonna go, let's say, 325. Whoops, almost went too cheap there, right? Yes, sir. Thank you. Insufficient change. Oh, so we want 11.51. We're already up at 46 dollars. That's uh, quite nice. 14.25. I'm just gonna, the mouse feels a little bit crazy. I can imagine it must be painful to look at as well. So is that more relaxed? I think this is better. Yeah, this is better, right? Yes, uh, let's get you set up here. You want $17 and change. This is where my my uh, childhood experience or teenhood experience working in the supermarket really shines. Sir? Oh, I thought he was going to leave. Because there is a thing in this game with shoplifters. And <laughs> of course he didn't look like one. He just looked very determined at reaching the exit. Hello. Okay, what would you like? You want a lot of flour and some pasta. I guess you'll be making a lot of sauce for that. Um, there we go. Should we order some more? I mean, we're getting pretty good at this, right? So we're going to get some oil. We're going to get some sugar. I think people have been buying a lot of bread. So, oops, I have taken too much. Let's just take something out. 
Let's take out the cereals. Oh, sorry, sir. There we go. Card. Nine, nine, nine. Let's get our groceries. At least one of them. Oh, that's a flower. Don't want to give yourself too much work. We can just set this down here. Yep. I wonder if they uh, begin to leave if you take too long. Okay, that's a lot of cereal, sir. But none of my business. It's your body. Oh, we're almost out of bread. I think we ordered bread, didn't we? Let's go out and have a look. This is bread. That's good. Can we fit it all? Let's just keep it over here for now. Really need a storage room for these extra wares. Now oh, we've got some sugar here. I'm just gonna throw this out. And then be ready at the cashiers. 624. Have a nice day, sir. Young lady. Weren't you just here before? $93. Wow. And what was it? 51? And then we got this young lady. 765. Whoop. Oh, got to get the last box in. It seems like it's getting to night time here. This is oil. And we need to price the uh, sugar as well. Otherwise, we're not going to be able to sell any. Hi, hi. 4.25. Whoops. Wow, we don't have any lights. What's going on with that? 50 cents back for you. So how do I turn on the light? Ah, there we go. <laughs> oh, this looks like a baddie. Be very discriminating here. He just took two sugars, that's fine. Sorry for discriminating, he just looks so angry. Sunglasses at night, sir. Oh, we didn't even price the oil yet. So we're going to set that at... Wow, it's way too low. We're going to set that at 3 dollars Oh, he's going to get it so cheap. That's why it took so many. Yeah, clever man. Uh, that's my own mistake, right? Whoops. That's a lot of flour. Is my flour priced wrong as well? Um, oh, we're here. No, nope, not dollars. You can take money back by right-clicking on the bills and the cash register. Okay, we're going to right-click that and we're going to give you 25 instead. There we go. Hello, sir. Money. One cent. Okay. Let's just take the flower. Market price is held. We uh, we do have a little bit extra over here. And we can throw this box out. And what was this? That was bread. Red. Press answer to finish the day. Yes? We got 24 satisfied customers. Store level, we got 136 points. We did an income of 90, 194, that means we actually earned $47. Uh, seven, $74, that's the right word. Well, I guess that was day one. So I'm gonna try and cut this up in a little smaller episodes to make it more like digestible for you guys. So. If you like this, please come back for the next episode, which will be day two. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.